Hey guys, welcome to Dub. If you're looking to crush your business goals with video, then you're in the right place. Dub is an all-in-one solution that allows you to create, customize, and distribute all your video content. So let's get right into it. The first thing Dub allows you to do is create your videos. But before we send videos out, we'll want to set a couple of things up on Dub to really optimize our video pages. So let's first do that. First, you'll want to come in here, click Settings. And under Profile here is where you can upload a headshot, we can include your contact information, such as your email, phone number, business line, job title, things like that. Once we've filled out these that we'd like to include on our video page as a type of email signature, then under video options, go ahead and check these boxes that you would like displayed. More on this in a second. So once we've included that little bit of contact information, let's go ahead and actually talk about creating our videos. So there are several ways we can create videos. We have a very powerful mobile app which is if you want instructions for that, you can click this eye icon right here, which opens up our video tutorial center. And down here at the bottom is a app or video with new app instructions. And that's going to show you step by step how to use the apps, very powerful recording functions. You can do things like clips and pausing and emojis and text on the screen, uh, lots of powerful functions without needing to a video editor. So definitely check that out. The next thing we have is the dub screen recorder which is this guy right here. This is the Dub Chrome extension. If I give this a click, it opens the extension up and now I'm recording my screen plus a little webcam video of me down there. It even has some annotation tools. I can either use my webcam, my profile picture, or, which, or just my voice. And now if I hit record, I can do things like um, record annotations on my screen like this. I can say, you know, click here, underline here, this is your proposal, sign here for this, and things like that. So that is the Chrome extension that you can use to create screen recordings. Lots of ways we can end those recordings, keyboard shortcuts and more. And again, there's gonna be a full video on the Dub Chrome extension right here in this tutorial center. So that is for screen recordings. And then finally, we have add-ons and integrations and also the ability to record right here on the website. So just go ahead and click plus, record with camera. There might be a permissions request right there in the top left corner. Make sure you grant yes to that permissions. Um, so once we record a video, let's go ahead and actually do that. See what it looks like. Three, two, one. Hey, it's just a test. Let's go ahead and upload that video. So now we've talked about the creation of the videos with the mobile app, the screen recorder, and then also we have add-ons and integrations in things like Gmail and Outlook and LinkedIn and HubSpot and many CRMs and other tools. And this is what that integration looks like is there's a little dub icon right inside of those tools. And if I give it a click, it gives me access to pre-recorded videos, and I can also record a brand new video right there inside of the integration that we have. So once we have created a video, the next step is customizing it. So you can see here this video I just created, and if I look at the view page, you can see that it already added a couple of buttons and things like that. So depending upon what your default settings are, it will automatically build this page. There's lots of details we can add. You can include custom call to actions, which are these videos with these little buttons that appear below the video. These buttons can be programmed to have them do just about anything we want. They can fill out a form, download an attachment, visit a URL. We can have them um, even re reply with videos of their own. So as I showed you, we can program these buttons to really do everything that we need to. Uh, the next thing is the design of the page. So we can upload our own logo there, which I always do recommend doing. So when we're on the dub page, we can actually do that right here in your settings. Under settings, under team, my team, you'll have the option to upload your own logo there. And this is that email signature section that I was showing you where um, none of these are checked here, but if we did under video options, such as name, you'll see if I check that box that says name and now refresh this page, it now has dub the name under there. So that's how that video email section works. Now, the other elements you can customize here are like the playlist. If I want additional videos to play, all I have to do is click a video there. I can either add more videos or search for it by name. You see here it says saved. And then now if I refresh this page, you can see videos are added there to the playlist. Other elements I can customize are the design, such as the background and the player color. I can choose this color to anything I'd like and set it as a default, meaning as I move forward, if I create new videos, it'll automatically apply that same color scheme. And then I can also choose backgrounds op options here. I can either search for a word. I just click the frame like that, and that's going to add a custom background. You can see it says saved. Now, if I refresh this page, that little background will be there. So that's another element you can design. Okay, so now we've talked about how to customize these video pages in terms of our own branding, our own logo, background, 
play button, call to action structure, email signature, lots of elements we can customize here on this video page. And again, in the video tutorial center, there are bite-sized videos for how to perform each of these. So there will be videos on how to customize video pages and on how to customize thumbnails. So let's talk about how to distribute these videos. We do have direct integrations with things like Gmail, Outlook, LinkedIn, um, many CRMs. So we have also what's called a universal copy and paste method. So here's that video that I just sent, right, or just created. If I want to send this video through to somebody, all I have to do is come in here. I can put in their email for tracking. So I'm going to go ahead and use this one right here. So you can see I can add that contact in here for tracking. If they're already in there, you would see that they're already a contact and I can just select it. And if not, then I can press enter or I can click there and add as a new contact. So once the contact is added to the database, now I can get really detailed tracking and know exactly when this contact opened up the video or watched the video, what percentage they watched and things like that. Again, there's a full tutorial video on how tracking works. Press copy. Now, if I press that copy button, I can now paste this video into just about any channel I want. I can paste it into Gmail or Outlook or LinkedIn or social channels like Facebook. I can put it in a text message just about anywhere I want. So that is how the copy and paste function works. So that will work. The next thing is this button here, which is the direct integrations. So say if we have or using a tool we have a direct integration with, such as Gmail or Outlook or one of those channels, as long as you have the Dub Chrome extension installed and you're logged into it, you will have these add-ons available. So you just give it a click, gives you access to your existing videos, which you can just click one of those videos to insert it, just like that, or you can record a brand new one. We can also send these videos, as I mentioned, through text message, emails, uh, social media messages, and Dub even has some in-house capabilities of sending out large broadcasts. So we can come into marketing and I can send out one video to an entire list of people or I can build out automated sequences of video emails as well. And again, in the video tutorial section, there will be full length videos on how to perform each one of these. So that covers it for the quick tutorial guys. We talked about how to create these videos through the mobile app, through the website, through the add-ons such as Gmail and stuff like that. And then also for screen recordings using the Chrome extension. Then we talked about how to customize these videos, meaning how to customize these video landing pages. When we're looking at these pages, we want to preview them just like that. We can see what they're going to look like ahead of time. So, and we can build these pages to really optimize what we're trying to do. Again, highly recommend watching some videos specific to your industry to figure out how to optimize these pages the best for your specific applications. And then we finally talked about distribution, which is we can use the copy and paste function and send these videos through either emails or any channel we want. And then we can also use the direct add-ons such as the ones in LinkedIn and Gmail and Outlook. We can use the integrations to send those videos. And then we also have the in-house sending capabilities that I described, such as the campaigns and automations. Here's an example of one we sent to about 16,000 people. So that is how the Dub platform works. For more questions, you can come to chat support, and then you can also search for articles and then search the video tutorial section as well.